of well, Sunday night's match between fourth and fifth. It was Marseille who took the lead through Soleimani Diawara. And it was soon 2 0. Jeremy Morel's terrific cross headed in. A young midfielder Florian Tovon, 2 and 2. Eighth of the season. Well, Anand Movember got Leon back into the match, halving the deficit with that stunning strike from distance. 2 1 at the break. But then it was all Andre Pierre Gignac. As he, a one man siege on the Leon goal. Lopez could only deny him for a moment, slipping under the keeper on his 250th Ligue 1 appearance. And soon he added a brace on what is his 16th of a very profitable season, tapping in. Claims for offside. They were shown to not be the case. Bavatembe Gomez made it 4 2. It's a big three points for Marseille in the battle for Europe. Well, Friday night saw Lille travel to Bastia, knowing a win would secure a podium place. It was Salomon Kalou who made the difference in the first half. His 14th of the season looked to have settled the matter. Terrific finish from the former Chelsea man. But Wabi Kazri's terrific header meant Girard's men will have to wait at least another week. Well, Saint Etienne have an outside chance of catching Lille as Roman Amuma set Lever on their way with this terrific strike. And Montpellier visiting here. Haven't had the best of times. And that strike continued the trend. Well, of more importance, Christophe Galtier's men are now a point from clinching fourth and an automatic entrance to the Europa League group stages. That rubber stand by Melvin Erding. 2 0, Laver. Well, Nantes punished a sloppy opening 10 minutes from host to lose. Osvaldo Vizcarondo beating Zachary Boucher for his first goal for the Canaries. Well, Toulouse, though, dominated the rest of the match, but it wasn't until the 67th minute when they finally drew level. Wissam Ben Yedder, suspicions all side, but terrific feat to beat Remy Rio. But off the ball, a clash with Papi Gilboji. Ben Yedder going down, cynical elbow from the defender, and a red card. 1 1 the final score. Well, Valencia's resistance finally ended as defeat to Bordeaux saw them relegated after eight seasons in the top flight. Gregory Sertic finding Julien Faubert, the villain at the Stade NO. On well, Evian will be worried they could join them, losing 1 0 to Rance, who ended a run of eight without a win. Terrific play down the right. And when the ball came across, Prid Orienge firing in. 1 0 to Rance. Lorient, though, are safe. They edged out bottom side Ajaxio thanks to Jeremy Aliadier's terrific finish. Brilliant play down the right. He finished from close range. Lorient survived with 10 men to claim all three points. Well, so show are keeping the clubs from 13th to 17th in league and sweating the third win in four. It was terrific play from Jordan Ayu. Terrific feet and skill. It was the unfortunate Nemanja Pesinovic with the own goal after the ball came across. And Ayu on loan from Marseille headed in. Massive three points for Ev Renard's men. A point from safety. Well, only eight fixtures this week, 36. That was because of the Brittany Coupe de France final, meaning PSG have to wait until Wednesday to reclaim their Ligue 1 crown, with Monaco already assured of second place after Lille's draw. Gangong and Rance need points to make them safe. Well, the podium place is all but confirmed with Saint-Étienne a point away 
from clinching fourth. OM's win means the fight for the final Euro place could go to the last day. Also shows when has dragged clubs who probably thought that they were safe back into the relegation mix. So show only a point from Evian and Gangon, with Rance, Nice and Montpellier still in need of points to breathe easier. Well, week 37 sees all teams play at 9 o'clock on Saturday. Lyon will hope to get back on track at home to Lyon. Well, Marseille can keep the pressure on with three points away to Bordeaux. And if results go their way, Sochaux could climb out of the bottom three for the first time since week three.